We're gonna test this out ourselves and Superforms had a good idea of possibly playing. I'm not gonna test this version out today, the, the one I'm about to talk about. But he was talking about Magical Merchant and with Magical Merchant, if you like take out all these, you're gonna mill your Archfiends and you're gonna add possibly a called Archie in your hand. That's pretty good. But for now, we're gonna test with Advanced Draw and Card of the Soul. Basically at 5,000 life points, you use Card of the Soul to search for Empress or you could search for Archfiend Emperor. This could also search for Necrofear, but we're not playing Necrofear. Advanced Draw, when you normal summon Archfiend Emperor, you could just uh, tribute it and draw two. Uh, Advanced Draw is supposed to help us get to our Call of the Archfiend. So let's see this. I, I honestly do not have high hopes for this, but we're here to test. Duel! There was some hesitation there. All right, he goes for the poly. He sets. He sets. He sets. Let's see if he posts his deck on the Discord. Let's snipe him. He's gonna snipe us. I'm gonna snipe him. Oh yeah, I have his deck. I have his deck. All right. What is that? The face down could be a Cosmic Cyclone, a Magic Drain, an Ultimate Providence, a Ryoku Field, and a Spell Shield Type 8. Boy, that's a lot of variants. All right. All right. All right. Um, so the only bad thing that could happen is if he Ultimate Providences, which he'd have to discard his hand. All right, I'm looking at your deck, bro. I'm looking at it. Back row. We gotta hit the Cosmic Cyclone. Yeah, yeah. Um, if this gets Cyclone, then whatever, man. Whatever. What? How am I gonna play? Right? It's a 30 card deck. Damn it. Ooh, no Cyclone. No Cyclone. Beautiful. Now we're gonna carefully play around Cyclone. This card may be Cyclone. Huh. Well, I mean, he would just use it. it it's not like, well, no, okay. Thank you. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Do you have something? Seven tools of the bandit. Should we have just popped stuff earlier with this? Maybe. Wow. Wow, bro. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. What are you doing? Your 30 card deck. Damn, we should have popped that. Should have popped it. Celestial with the dollar. Your hard work is an inspiration, bro. I wish I knew website stuff so I could help. We also should have banished the Archfiend Emperor. I, I'm, I'm like 10 steps ahead of all of you guys. If you guys are even saying anything, probably not. Looks like we win. 30 card deck. Woo! Get out of here! I mean, I, I showed it yesterday. This is what it looks like to submit a deck list. You don't need a web, you don't need website knowledge at all. So if any of you are paying attention right now and you want to help with the website, here's here's what it looks like to submit a deck list. You you literally go on the website, you log in, and you submit deck lists like this. You type up a deck list, you submit it. We do have a ton of uh oh, there we go. Destiny Heroes, we do have a lot of people that just joined to help with decklist submitting. You could also help by gathering King of Game decklists from other websites. I can make a channel where you guys just post King of Game decklists from other websites in uh, Brazil, Japan, YouTube, Reddit. There's a there's a game there's a King of Game decklist at least once per month on Reddit, and you could grab it, post it on the Discord, and then 
you all will put it on the website like this. You know, give author credit, all that good stuff. Because I don't want our King of Game decklist to just be from the Discord. So that is a great way to help. Also, um, yeah, just converting guides. Just you're basically, it's just a lot of copy pasta. That's the website. Dangerous. Combos. The combos. I'm gonna be playing something similar to this on uh, the stream for the King of, for King of Games today. Um. Yeah, sure. Well, the thing is, uh, I don't know. I I think I Justin. It's for the it's for the website Discord. Uh, but maybe I want to make it a community effort. Yeah, maybe. <sighs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Yes. What you got, bro? Ooh, Econ Take to prevent me from destroying Dangerous. Okay, that's that's pretty good. Honestly, that does really screw me. That really screws me. But we have 5k life. We good. If this these if these were called the Archfiend. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah, our, our whole plan... Is in shambles now. We are screwed. We're screwed. Once again, we're wondering if we should have just said Doom Dog or Throws. I don't know. I think we're getting too greedy with the with the horror. This is number two. We should have just set Orthros, I think. Yeah, yeah, we gotta set Orthros more, guys. We gotta do that. We gotta do that, because we only have so much life points to take hits from. And his whole deck would have fell apart. Like, we would have literally dominated him. My website is online for Discord members. Um, you just have to, you make a Discord account, and then you, now you have access to the website. Just like that. Wait, weren't you just COG now? I have, um, I have a way to reset my COG rank. So I hit COG, and then I do it again, and again, and again. We hit King of Games, I think, four or five times last month. I get, oh! Just what we needed, okay? We set Doomdog Orthros and he attacked it. That's what happened. That's the story I'm sticking to. All right, uh, can you dispute that? No, you cannot. Let's go, Dangerous. Is there currently a way, is there gonna be a forum section on the website? Uh, no, there's gonna be comment section. You can do comments on each page. Uh, the forum for the website is the Discord. That's it, man. That's it. If you want to discuss the game with the top players, you do it through the Discord. Uh, initially, I had a plan with a, a forum like a, like a year ago, but then Discord came out, and I really think that the Discord just replaces a forum. It's much better, so I'm not going to try to do that. Forget that. Wait, so you have multiple accounts? No, who said that? Come on, bro, seriously. Don't accuse me of that. Easy! This deck is unbeatable. If you play right. Unbeatable. Cannot lose. It's ridiculous. Get that out of here. Oh my god, we, <laughs> we could still summon that from the grave too. Oh my lord! Two decks we test today and they're both winners. Both of them are winners. Isn't this the deck you made? I showed this deck yesterday, cool. yes. All right, we got plays. We got plays, once again. If we don't draw this, we're gonna draw a card of the soul. We would draw advanced draw. So like, the whole deck is balanced. No, wanking off. I was a lurker. I never made an account. I, I, I strictly lurked. What do you think? Is it greedy to use... Um, I mean, we have to draw into a fiend. Come on. We're going to draw into a fiend. I have no idea what we're playing against. I think probably... We're going to play... We're playing against aliens. Aliens, aliens, aliens. Aliens. So let's... Let's 
Do destroy the monster. We're going to advance draw. Okay. All right, let's draw two. And let's set up. We have to draw a fiend. Like, we're going to. Come on. Fiend. Thank you. Thank you. Now we're set up. That was free. That was for free. Check the advantage here. Check it. We got four cards with uh, Synergy in the Graveyard, Synergy from our Banish Pile, and he's got three cards. That works for me. Silence X with a dollar. I wanted to do this, Pepe, please. Thank you, Silence X, for the dollar. What did you want to do? I'm clicking on the image and it's not working. Let me see. Okay, what is this? Okay. Okay. Battle phase. All right, let's see. Let's see what you got, bro. Let's see. Let's see. Let's let's do this. Let's do this. Yes. Do you have a cosmic cyclone? All right. So now we decide if we want to put an attack or defense based off the alien counters. So if he were to put four alien counters on us, basically you do four times three. That is twelve. Then. 30 minus 12 is 18. So if we put him in defense, we will lose to a recombination, but we're going, but if we put him in uh, attack, he can econ take. If he econ takes, that's 3000 plus 16 in the grave if he powerful rebirths, we're still okay with that. And he commits to an econ take when we have a, uh, we have the dark dimension. So I would like to bait him to econ take, I welcome it. And he also can't recombination swing over if we put an attack. So all that decision making into putting it in defense or attack. There you go. Still going for the attack. Maybe it's a super rush. Recombination. Now this forces him to dump a overlord. So otherwise he would have been able to keep overlord in the deck. If he's playing aliens with just one overlord, this is good for us. Now he has to lose his overlord. Or he just does four. Okay, it's a brainwashing beam. That's fine. That's fine. Wait, what are you doing, bro? What are you doing, bro? Is this the econ take? We're forcing him to econ take right here. All right, fine. Econ take? I mean, you still don't have game of econ take. Pimp DK, chill! All right, there's no econ take. It was just to uh, get two aliens on the field. That's fine. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to be okay with this. We're going to take 17. That's fine. He's kind of screwed. Come on, right? <laughs> like, what is he going to do? What is he going to do? All right, not much you could do here. Okay. We're going to discard this. We're going to banish the Empress. Let's get the, the alien kid off the field, bro. Get that out of here. Come on. Get out of here. Come on. Domination. Domination. Now he can't search for Overlord and, and because we'd have a counter on our monster. And he thinks we possibly have a fiend in our hand by keeping it. All right, swing with the Empress first. Is this game? I don't even calculate this anymore. <laughs> Just game! All right, um, I don't know. Our decks are doing too good today.